analysis of variance ANOVA multiple choice questions total 15 MCQs first question DAS has introduced the terms variance in the analysis of statistical data option A WS Gosset option B Abelson option C R A Fisher option D Snedeker here we have answer option C R A Fisher has introduced the terms variance in the analysis of statistical data. Next question. In ANOVA, an attempt is made to find out whether the means given by a number of samples are significantly different from one another. Option A, true. Option B, may be true. Option C, may be false. Option D, false. Answer is Option A true. In ANOVA, an attempt is made to find out whether the means given by a number of samples are significantly different from one another. Next question. ANOVA is carried on the basis of a ratio between the variances and ratio not between the variances. Option A false. Option B true. Option C may be true. Option D may be false. So answer is option B, true. ANOVA is carried on the basis of a ratio between the variances and ratio not between the variances. Next question. Analysis of variance is a statistical method of comparing the dash of several populations. Option A, standard deviations. Option B, variances. Option C, means. Option D, proportion so here we have answer option c means analysis of variance is a statistical method of comparing the means of several populations next question the dash sum of squares measures the variability of the observed values around their respective treatment means option a treatment option b error option c interaction option d total so here we have answer option b error the error sum of squares measure the variability of the observed values around their respective treatment means next question as variability due to chance decreases the value of f will option a increase option b stay the same option c decrease option d none of these so answer is option A increase as variability due to chance decreases the value of F will increase. Next question when conducting an ANOVA F value will always fall within what range? Option A minus infinity to plus infinity. Option B 0 to plus infinity. Option C minus infinity to 0 option d 0 to 1 so here we have answer option b that is 0 to plus infinity when conducting an ANOVA f value will always fall within 0 to plus infinity range next question a one way ANOVA is used for three or more groups of data to gain information about the relationship between the dependent and independent variables option a false option b may be true option c true and option d may be false so answer is option c true a one way ANOVA is used for three or more groups of data to gain information about the relationships between the dependent and independent variables next question the formula for ANOVA is F is equal to MST that is mean sum of squares due to treatment divided by MSE that is mean sum of square due to error. Option A true, option B may be true, option C false, option D may be false. So here we have answer option A true. The formula for ANOVA is F is equal to MST means sum of square due to treatment divided by MSE means sum of square due to error. 
नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन द फॉर्मूला फॉर एनोवा इज एफ इज इक्वल टू वेरियंस बिटवीन सैंपल्स डिवाइडेड बाय वेरियंस विद इन सैंपल्स ऑप्शन ए मे बी ट्रू ऑप्शन बी ट्रू ऑप्शन सी फॉल्स ऑप्शन डी मे बी फॉल्स सो हियर वी हैव आंसर ऑप्शन बी ट्रू द फॉर्मूला फॉर एनोवा इज एफ इज इक्वल टू वेरियंस बिटवीन सैंपल्स डिवाइडेड बाय वेरियंस विद इन सैंपल्स नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन in anova it is assumed that to get the variations of the elements in a mixed population by separating them and to find their values option a may be false option b may be true option c false option d true here we have answer option d true in anova it is assumed that to get the variations of the elements in a mixed population by separating them and to find their values next question in anova it is assumed that the populations from which the samples have been drawn have identical means and variances option a may be false option b true option c false option d may be true so answer is option b true in anova it is assumed that the populations from which the samples have been drawn have identical means and variances next question in anova null hypothesis is taken as h0 that is means of different samples do not differ significantly option a true option b may be false option c false option d may be true so answer is option a true in anova null hypothesis is taken as means of different samples do not differ significantly next question in anova one way classification degrees of freedom for source of variation between classes is option a b1 is equal to h minus 1 option b v2 is equal to capital n minus h option c capital n minus 1 option d none of these so answer is option a b1 is equal to h minus 1 in anova one way classification degrees of freedom for source of variation between classes is b1 is equal to h minus 1